All right, Wildcats fans, we're back this week. It was the first home game of the season against Hazelwood West, 63 to zero. Um, I got the players of the week this week. Also a big shout out to Bone Auto Glass for um, sponsoring the Wildcats. We really do appreciate it. And I'm here with? Jack McMillan. And what player of the week did you get this week? Defensive player of the week. Nice, you had five tackles to assist, fumble recovery. How are you feeling after that first home game? feel pretty good. It felt good to be in front of the fans again. Uh, just getting back at it. Yeah, awesome. Um, how did you prepare for the whole season itself? Um, all the work in the summer, in the weight room, and all the open gyms in the winter. Awesome. Um, what sets Eureka apart from other teams? I th I'd say the work ethic. Awesome. Um, let's see. What is your game day song choice? Um, I have to say TSU by Drake. Good song, good song. And what is your favorite NFL team? Uh, the Colts, even though they're not the best right now. <laughs> it's all right. That's all right. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. All right. Next up we have Drew Swingle. And what player did you get this week? I got Trench Player of the Week. Awesome. Um, this week, your team captain, it's your senior year. How are you feeling with that first game of the season at home and you won 63 to zero? I was, I was so excited to come out. Like, uh, I'd had, I had a smile the whole day and uh, I was just super excited to get out in front of that crowd, in front of that cat pound and, uh, you know, get back to these home games. I mean, they're a lot better in the way, but I had a, I had a fun time. It's, it's a lot of energy. I'll tell you that. How does it feel being on, uh, in the trench and how do you lead the team? Uh, you, I mean, you're, there's part of leading by example, and uh, you just got to put on a good example for the young guys. And then there's the part of, uh, you know, leading by voice, you know, telling the young guys what's uh, right and wrong and, uh, you know, showing them the right way. That's awesome. Um, how did you prepare for the season? Um, you know, there's your personal part of, you know, getting in the weight room and, you know, just studying the plays, learning everything, uh, you know, all the techniques and uh, just, you know, what we'll be going against during the season. And then there's the part of, uh, you know, kind of helping the younger guys around you that might not be as experienced, you know, getting them ready for the varsity season. You're definitely a team leader, and I can see that. Um, what is your pre-game song choice? Um, Michael Myers theme song. <laughs> okay, okay, it's different, but I like it. Um, and favorite NFL team? Uh, go Pack Go, Packers, baby. All right, thank you. All right, next up we got? Alan Brown. And what player of the week did you get this week? I got special teams player of the week. Awesome. You had a big game this past week. Um, once again, with that 63-0 to zero home game, how are you feeling? I'm feeling great. You know, I kind of expected it, you know, so when the game expected that. So. so it's your senior year. You got team captain. Um, how do you feel about the rest of the season after these two, for, two first big games? Uh, I'm feeling great, but the season, it's not. it just started. You know, this is the only game, too. We're, in, we're on to game three, and we got to keep pushing. Um, what are some strategies you went into with this game? Uh, wait, so the last game, Parkway yeah. West? Yeah, yep. Uh, you know, just beat them to the outside. The team's not very good at tackling, so we got to get to the outside and make big plays. Definitely, definitely saw that during this game. <laughs> um, what is your pregame song choice? Pregame song choice is definitely The Grinch by Trippy Red. The song gets me uh, turn. <laughs> it's a great song. And favorite NFL team? Uh, Eagles, Philly, you know. Got it. Thank you. No problem. Next up we have? Casey Holbman. And what player did you get this week? Uh, offensive player of the week. Two time, two time. Um, first home game of the season. How did it feel? The energy was crazy. How was it feeling after? Yeah, it's a lot different when you go out there and you're starting and everybody, you know, <laughs> is just cheering. They're all so loud and it's, it's a little overwhelming. Yeah. Um, how do you approach each game you're going into? Uh, just by preparing the same every week, you know, get better at preparing, get better at, you know, the new calls, the new plays, everything, just working hard and getting ready mentally too. Of course. Um, how do you, what is the most exciting aspect of this game? Uh, last game? Last game, the game, like football in general, what is like something that you just love about this game? Oh, um, I gotta say, just the all like it takes to win a game of football. It's like you gotta be brothers with the guy next to you, and it takes all eleven uh, of the people on your team on the field to make a play succeed, and you gotta do that for the whole game. So that's the that's the beauty of it. Absolutely, I definitely feel like 
Eureka is very, it's a family and you can see that every single game, um, especially with 63 to zero, like you guys are playing as a unit and that's awesome. Um, what is your pre-game song choice? Uh, I actually, I actually don't listen to music before the game. So, so what do you do before the game? Uh, I kind of just you like sounds, mellow out, kind of just chill. Yeah, it sounds weird, but I, I kind of sit in silence by myself and just hey. get mentally ready. What, whatever you gotta do, whatever you gotta do. Um, and favorite NFL team? Oh, Chicago Bears. All right, thank you.